So as a lot of you know, Special Operations 2 for Ghost Recon Wildlands has officially been announced and we've gotten the teaser trailer as well as what the theme is going to be. Now one of the things that I have been seeing around a lot of people asking is that they didn't announce anything about the new classes coming with Special Operations 2. Now of course on Monday, July 23rd, we'll be getting the full trailer for the Special Operations 2 so I'm sure that they will tease the classes or talk about the classes within that trailer. But it actually looks like if we head on over to the Ubisoft blog, they've already posted up a bit of a teaser of what the new classes are going to be so in total we are going to be getting two new classes and the image that i'm going to show you guys in the background right now is exactly the two symbols that they showed as a bit of a teaser for the upcoming classes now if we take a quick look at the one on the right hand side the moment that i saw this i instantly remembered about something from just a little bit of time that i have put into rainbow six siege this instantly sparked something in my mind now as i'm sure all of you already know the strong theme for special operations 2 is going to be rainbow six siege and if we really take a look at this symbol who does it remind you of within the siege universe when it comes to the silhouette that they showed as well as the symbol that they showed this is a direct representation of doc from rainbow six siege now this can be extremely interesting just for the simple fact that we could maybe have a way of finally healing players within the field without actually having to be on top of them or who knows we might be able to even heal players that are not even down now as for the other silhouette and the other class that was kind of teased a little bit, we aren't 100% sure, well personally, I'm not 100% sure on what this could be. It does seem to be like some type of class that has a gas mask on and it does have a biohazard symbol. So we could be looking at another drone class, maybe with some other new little feature. But honestly, I'm going to leave that one up to you guys to let me know in the comments. One thing that I do know for sure, and I feel very confident about it, is the fact that the one on the right hand side is more than likely going to be some type of Doc or maybe even Doc himself. If we put side by side pictures, we can see that the silhouette has some type of helmet on with a visor. And if we look at the pictures of Doc from Rainbow Six Siege, we can see that he has the same exact thing. Personally, I feel like that one is just a dead giveaway. I don't know. Maybe I'm completely wrong and you guys are thinking of something else different. But like I said before, I'm really curious to hear what all of you have to say. So let me know in the comments down below. I will have a link to the full UB blog post in my description down below if you guys want to go and check that out. But if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to drop a like on it. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for all types of different content. Remember, Monday we will be getting the full trailer for Special Operations 2. So we're going to get a look at the classes as well as a closer look of the maps. But the moment that that trailer goes live, I will be covering covering it here on the channel so make sure that you guys turn on those notifications but anyways like always i will see you guys in the next video he's on the back of the hill behind that thing that i just put carbon i think he ran past him got him well i got one of them ah got him nice, nice. <coughs> Wow. <clears throat> I threw my mic.